There once was a day with no SBC Seri a tats and hello week Said tuta katsate malakia But wait what's this? It's ball and got leak Can't stop this shine is what Manny says This card will leave your defenders dead He's great on the ball with a techno dribble I need to get him and my foot champs red No, it's fine to boot FIFA 21 content during talks Sometimes maybe good, sometimes maybe shit It's Malakias The only 1pm content I care about is this freaking Dunkin' Donuts kid Freaking love Dunkin' guy <laughs> What's up, boys, and welcome to the 96th team of the season, Balangali, a.k.a. Romelu Lukaku, a.k.a. Big Rom. There was no 1 p.m. content today for team of the season to end Serie A, which is a little bit disappointing. We didn't see a flashback Ibra, which I don't think anyone was really expecting realistically based on all the stuff that happened earlier this year, um, oh, later last year. Uh, we did not get ourselves a, uh, a Duhan Vlahovic, a Dusan Vlahovic. We didn't get ourselves a Mkhitaryan, a Sergei Milinkovic Savic, for that matter. Didn't get many SPCs at all, so in, in my opinion... It's probably like La Liga, Bundesliga 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, ones to watch. Uh, maybe Serie A team of the season there, and then like spot 175 is Premier League team of the season. So it's been really weird to see these team of the seasons either be hit or miss. Um, and uh, unfortunately, I mean like I'm happy with some of the stuff that we got for Serie A. Chucky Lozano was a dub, Varela was a dub. Uh, so the, 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 the team of the season release was actually pretty damn decent. Uh, the DePaul's a really great card. But more importantly, we got ourselves this freaking Lukaku. But yeah, by, in, by, in, uh, by far an average, by far an average, did I just list a body type trying to describe a promotion? I don't think anyone disagrees with me here, but the Serie A Tots has been just really, really underwhelming. It seems, it's looked like it started off pretty good, and then it just kind of become a little bit more underwhelming. But, um... You know, sometimes you got to create your own content, and that's what we do here on the channel. So today, we are looking at none other than FIFA Manny's main man himself, and the guy who broke the Cuntleton, the first guy to break the Cuntleton goal-scoring record for a single weekend league run, uh, Romelu Lukaku, a.k.a. Big Rom. Loved his Rule Breakers card all the way back, it seems like it was, what, four or five months ago, and now he gets himself another special card to the tune of 1.3 million coins. So it is not a cheap card by any means, and is not a card I've been able to come close to affording on the RTG, and we may, in fact, with the rewards and everything tonight, do one final set to see if maybe we can get the big man and just love him in real life, man. He's one of those guys that's worked so hard and deserves everything that's come his way. Won the uh, Serie A with, uh, with Inter, and now it looks like there's stuff going on with Inter. It looks like him, maybe Bastoni, Conte is already out. Uh, I think uh, uh, Inter paid, paid him like 7 mil. But I think Conte did leave. I don't think he was sacked. Uh, but now that Conte is going, a lot of the guys are discussing uh, possibly uh, possibly getting out of there. So, yeah, Lokaku said, uh, Thanks, Antonio. You changed me as a player and made me stronger. We won together. Winning is, and it's all that matters to you. And I'm glad that I've had you as a coach. I'll take your principles for the rest of my career. I owe you a lot. And that's just stuff that you love to see, man. You love to see you love to see a player-coach uh, relationship like that. And you can tell that the Inter boys just really care about each other. So... Now that we have that out of the way, we can focus on the card, which I've wanted to get my hands on and literally spent all morning selling off everything in the club, all my 83s and 82s, and we finally have ourselves Tots Balangali, and we're going to see if there's anyone in Ultimate Team, at least in Division Rivals, that can stop the shine of this 96 rated card. Smash like for Inter, Romelu, Lukaku, if you absolutely love the guy. Smash like if you guys want to get him in your reds. Smash like if you did get him in your reds. If you guys are new to the channel, hit that subscribe button down below. So the first thing you're going to notice uh, is that he's got the four-star skill moves. He got that upgrade, has always had the four-star weak foot, but gets himself skill moves now. We go over to the stats. The engine chem style is the most popular chem style to put on him. 95 acceleration, 99 sprint speed. He's a big body, so we're going to see if he feels fast. He, did, he felt super fast with the Rule Breakers card, uh, but the thing that really pops about this card is the combination of the 99 Sprint Speed and the 99 Strength uh, and the Ridiculous Bounce that goes up to 95, has 99 Reactions, goes up to 99 Dribbling, 94 Ball Control, and has... Uh 94 agility, and we're going to see maybe if he even has a little bit of techno dribbling in him. The shooting stats we don't even need to talk about. They're all 99s. Every literally important shooting stat is in the 99. Uh, he's got even 92 curve, and that's and 92 vision. That's probably one of the most underrated aspects of his game. The fact that he's he led, I think he led the Serie A in goals and assists. No, didn't lead it in, in goals, but he led it in assists? Second in goals, second in assists. Absolutely love to see something like that. He has himself power header trait. Uh, no real traits to speak of, but with the stats that he has and the four-star, four-star combo you don't really need them now Lautaro Martinez is a guy that I got in my guaranteed team of the season pack uh, on the RTG and today I thought we would show both the really expensive interruption and then also the more Tesco budget uh, interplayer even though this card looks absolutely nuts in his own right in some respects might even look a little bit better also has power header uh, and has flair has four star four star as well we got to name the squad Ball, long, golly, ball and golly. Match number one with ball and golly. I dare anyone out there to try and stop the shine. Match number one, Fafangula. Dub. Legend. No van a ganar partido, arquero. Claro que sí, son tan importantes como el goleador. 
Sigue buscando el lugar adecuado. Se quita el balón de encima, liberándose de presión. Nice. Power header trait. Martínez. En cualquier momento tira la culebrita. Lautaro Martínez, hang out with your boy. Martínez. Nah, you don't want any of the shine. You want to know what? You can't stop the shine. Not with Romelu Lukaku, dude. Romelu Lukaku should not be able to do that with his size. Hey, have a word. That, is that a pen? That's it. That was inside the box, right? What's he got for pens? Let's do a uh, let's do a De Gea. Okay. Wait, what? How did he? How did he do that? Bro, look up. I was dumb. I should have shot that. I should have shot that a little bit earlier. Techno dribbling. Wig horse. That represents the point in Lukaku's career where, every, uh, career where everyone doubted him. That's what, that's what you'd love to see. That's not what you'd love to see. Do you, do you, see, the, do you see the quick cuts? He's out of here. Mal Gomez, he's he, like, listen, sometimes, sometimes he, sometimes you come up against a player and they just know that they're outmatched. Or I don't know, may, maybe he need, maybe he feels like he needs to bring in a sub, but there's so far no one that's been able to stop Romelu Lukaku shine. What a great first save from Neuer. What a great first save from Neuer, man. Vissam Ben Yedder, could we be seeing a team of the season card of him tomorrow? Come on, Big Rom. That's gotta be in. And that's a pen. You know what? We're gonna... Let's go! You can't stop the shine! You cannot stop the shine! The combination of Lautaro Martinez coming in, hugging his boy out. They absolutely love to do it. And wouldn't you know it, the absolute goats. The absolute inter-freaking goats, dudes. Do you see how he just wiggles around, guys? A little body faint there. I'm getting a little bit cute with it. How a player of his size can move like that, man. Luca, he's broken. He's 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 actually a broken guard. And then he, now, now he's just absolutely living his best. We already know who's going in to collect the game ball. It is none other than Balangali, aka Romelu Lukaku. Took him 10 attempts to get five goals. That's a 50% conversion rate on all his chances on net. Uh, and if you have 10 total attempts, you put five through. You're doing pretty. You're doing pretty well for yourself. So, again, the main thing, and it's the thing that I was expecting because I do have a lot of experience. I had about 40 games worth of experience uh, with the Rule Breakers, Balangali, with the uh, with the Rule Breakers, Roman Lukaku, and he is just an absolute monster. Strength even provided an assist. This is really where Roman Lukaku sets himself apart from the bunch, as as a big guy to be able to do this. Look, look at this. Nice little body faint. Left analog stick dribbling, a nice little burba spin, nice little heel flick, and then a pop. Dub. Lukaku. Legend. 
Positioning, ball control, everything is phenomenal. That's La that, that's Lautaro Moti that's Lautaro Martinez connecting with his boy. You see, you see the control. Straight choo choo. Out in the field, I'm running. Best striker I've used in the game. So every now and again, some of you guys will ask me, "Zway, give me your best, uh, give me your best attacking option, give me your best like, uh, give me your best striker for over a million coins or something like that." Romelu Lukaku is the best, is the best striker card that I've used. You want to know what I absolutely love? I was expecting all of this the moment I bought his card because of the familiarity. familiarity Ready? Got him. Romelu, Romelu. Step number one. Have a sick player like Ramadu. <laughs> the techno dribbling, dude. The techno dribbling. Let me ask you a question. Do you think you can stop the shine? The answer is no. The answer is no, you can never stop the shine. The celebration. Look at the acceleration. Look at the look at the T-Rex run animation. Look at the look at the body thing. I woke up this morning with 600,000 coins on the account. I spent two or three hours selling all my 82s, 83s, 84s, a bunch of my uh, high-rated players, some of the team of the season cards tradable that I didn't know that I had, and I got just the right amount of coins to be able to afford Lukaku. If you're looking to have fun with a big man, this is the card for you. Sure, 1.3 million coins is a hell of a lot of money, but if you're spending 1.3 million coins on a card, it better be the likes of a Romelu Lukaku. So for value, I am going to say, and I would only give this rating around this time of the year, given what he's done for us, given how fast he feels, agility, ball control, that he has forced our skill moves now, four out of five in terms of five, in terms of on the, on the infinity gauntlet, in terms of value. Usually would not give this uh, sort of rating for an, a player that this is a, that's this expensive, but again, the stage that the game we're in uh, dictate, uh, dictates dictates this rating. On the pitch performance, I gotta give him a four and a half out of five. Just lit it up, did everything we asked of him. He's got the fake body shot exit uh, of dreams. He's, he's evil, even able to do a little bit of techno dribbling. And uh, again, the most important thing with a big striker like this, most important thing, not only that he feels actually agile and lives up to the hype of the agility, the 94 dribbling, uh, but the fact that he can finish everything, everything inside the box and he delivered on that promise. He over-delivered on his top end, top end sprint speed, right? Because he is uh, he is a big dude and you wouldn't expect him to be super fast, but he glides with that unique little T-Rex pterodactyl running animation. Uh, and he's just an absolute silky, silky yam boy. So he gets the silky yam boy stamp of approval. Uh, if you guys did enjoy the episode, yeah, smash like on the video. If you guys are new to the channel, hit that subscribe button down below. Let me know if you guys, if you guys got either Lukaku or Lautaro in, the re in your reds. Lautaro was obviously incredible as well. Um, and uh, yeah, just a really, really fun, uh, fun couple games with, uh, with, with players that we absolutely love up the inter boys uh but also more importantly die roma maybe next season with Mourinho. the absolute the absolute memes i cannot wait for it but anyway boys gonna be on stream later tonight for my rewards uh and then just uh just hanging out just a chill little thursday night stream on twitch uh link will be in the description below but uh, like i said i'll catch you guys for another upload tomorrow hopefully a banging start to league on tots uh but i will catch you guys for another upload tomorrow till next time my bros choose later ade